See, now we have our diving board and everything else, but we gotta create water. And you're gonna ask, how are you gonna create water, Bruce? Well, simple enough. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to a craft store and you're just gonna buy blue cellophane. Very simple, very easy. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna lay strips down of your blue cellophane. Now you're gonna take clear packing tape and you're gonna do your seams, okay? Don't worry about the edges, just do your seams. And you're gonna come out as far as you'd like, depending on the size of your stage and your room. Now before you start laying the cellophane, what I want you to do is unroll it and have the kids just take it and I want you to crumple it all up and after you crumple it up, go ahead and lay it back down. You're gonna say, why Bruce? Because what that does is it gives you little ripples in the water when you put your lighting on it, it just gives it that extra added effect and detail. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take a very simple box cutter and you're gonna take this box cutter and using very, very little pressure on it, is you're gonna take your box cutter and you can see what we did here is we created this undulating line that just gives it a nice, cool look and feel so it's not all jaggedy and stuff. Then what we did is we went around it with clear packing tape again to tape down the edges so the kids don't trip on it. So after we cut all our stuff and the volunteers pulled away, we had some extra stuff that they were throwing out. And I go, wait, hold on, don't throw it out. So what you do is you take the extra stuff, you crimple it up, and look what you can do with it. It looks like bubbles and like the water has movement, so don't throw that extra cellophane out.